Hey guys, how y'all doing today? My name is Franchise Fanatic, and welcome back to the channel, and to David, if you guys, it's another LEGO Harry Potter video today, we're tackling again, Deathly Hollows Part 1, Love Goods Lunacy. Let's do this. Let's do this. We gotta get Love Good and her, her crazy lunacy hijinks, and we still can't put together the tent, but whatever. Ooh, the home of Luna Love Good and Xenophilius Love Good. Dude, no one talks about Luna, man. She's kind of hot. I mean, she's kind of out there. But, you know, she's kind of kind of pretty, I guess. Mm, okay, so the, the Death Eaters took Luna. And uh, Xenophilius is kind of bummed out, not gonna lie. Well, I guess they're not home. Come on, guys. Let's bail. Is that a melon? Does that look like a monkey with a watermelon for ears? For ears, right? Yeah, that was weird. Oh, man, dude! Plays Hermione, why not? Look at these graphics, man! I say it every time! I literally say it every time I play this! But holy cow! Look at that! It kind of looks like a painting more than real sky, but that looks good. See, like the... See my reticle right here? Like, look at that! Like, these... The clouds moving here? Very, uh, faintly and slightly? Vaguely? That's cool. So, if you guys are uh, interested, I got everything done. I got 100% in this level. So, uh, we're just going to kind of... Still going to try to hit 50,000, but let's see what we can do here. So, oh, who's this? Well, I'll get him anyway. You know why? He'll give me some money. There you go. What were you doing over here anyway, though? Shouldn't you be... Oh, purple stud! Bam! Shouldn't you be learning? Whatever. Say what you want, because this game technically isn't, even, in the, you know, the 1 through 4 one, these games technically aren't open world, quote-unquote, but they have free roaming in them. You know what I mean? Like, you can still explore the Hogwarts castle and the, the, the common grounds and all that. In this game, I'm when I complete this game, the levels I'm going to do, a you know, like I did for the first one, I'll do like a big uh, open world free roam video, but uh, I do think that these, this was kind of like, I think, the Kickstarter to... Um, you know, because, you know, this came out in 2011, so next year we had LEGO Batman 2, which was the first quote-unquote open-world LEGO game, but, you know, open-world Gotham City. Um, and this kind of, you know, laid the groundwork. And I think that, again, while these aren't quote-unquote open worlds, they still have a lot of free room. So I think that it'd be, re after they complete the Skywalker Saga, I think it'd be kind of neat if they maybe did, like, uh, another reimagining of these, maybe like a, the eight Harry Potter films and Fantastic Beasts. You know, kind of slide those into that and just kind of uh, make a big, massive, you know, like an actual true and true open world. Because I know we're getting Hogwarts Legacy next year and all that. But uh, I do think that, honestly, having a, a, you know, like a true Lego game open world like we've been getting, that would be cool. I don't know why. I think Lego game open worlds are better than normal open worlds just because they're more fun. You know what I mean? Like, there's no, like, high-impact violence or, you know, I like, I don't like violence, but, you know, I like action. I like normal games, but for some reason there's a, there's a there's a fun sense of aura around these Lego games. You don't really get with many other video games, you know? You don't really get that. And uh, I think it'd be pretty dope if we could get, like, a true open world. Same with Pirates. Like, when I play, I'm going to be playing Lego Pirates of the Caribbean soon. And um, that game, the free roam in that game is complete butt. I mean, it, it's poop. It's like, if you remember, and I'll show it when I play it eventually, but it's like the freaking dock, you know, where, like, you make port. We does it make both? You know, that that thing. And it's just like, it's literally just the freaking pier. Like, that's it. It's, it's the pier, and then there's like an area to the left and an area to the right, and that's it. That's all you effing get, you know? Pirates of the Caribbean, compared to this game, is a true open world game. It's crazy. I don't know. Do you do anything, or do you, you just... <laughs> open up Xenophilius, I'm hijacking... I'm Hermione's Grand Theft Auto in your balloon mobile. I don't know what the... What am I doing, though? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna use Augmenti. I'm gonna squirt on this and see what happens. Boop. All right, my one... Uh, squ oh, shoot. Sorry, Harry. My fault. Hey, Ron. Wait. Hey, wait. Hey, Ron. Turn it. Hey, Ron. Hey, Ron! <laughs> okay. Um, 
Oh, I see. I need to shoot that. I got it. Okay. Now we need to switch over to Ron because he used his Weasley boots. Oh, wait. Hang on. What? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That was weird. Blab gab it. It's for a dark wizard. Poop. All right. Well, I guess... I guess uh, we just have to shoot these, I think. I think. Let's see here. Um, yeah, okay, I got it. Let loose the orange balloon. Hit the second kite. And now we need to get rid of that kite. And I think we need to build like a... Normally in LEGO games, that purple right here, the purple you're seeing here, normally that is... Uh, you put something on top of that to build. And I think that's what we're going to be doing here. I think so. Right? I'm just going to... I'm not going to get all these. I just want to get a few more to get the money. Um, cause God knows I don't need it, but, <laughs> you know, I want to try to get 50,000. Because I haven't been doing that as of late. There you go, I told you, see? Franchise fanatic ain't that dumb. Boy, I baby! Smash all the leaves! Uh, yeah, what the fudge is that, man? Look at that, it looks like a, a monkey with watermelon for a head. That's kind of strange. Okay, Hermione, um, try knocking again, babe. Boop. Hey, stupid, you home? Open up, I need to use the bathroom. Oh, thank God, I've had to piss for months. Oh, not you. I mean, I'm coming. Boys in the you got quite a dump. Oh, yes, well... <laughs> I'm not crazy here. Come up, my... Oh, wow. <laughs> so, wait, he was doing an Irish jig. And Hermione's like, No! Let me... Hermione, would you please uh, tell me the story? Follow me up my stairs. This isn't creepy at all. I have ice cream. Hurry now, come, come. Harry, what the hell's wrong with that guy? Run, don't be gentle. It's kind of funny that, I don't know if they do that in this level, but this is like an effing horror level, jeez. It's like the snake one. Um, I do think that the whole scene in this film where Hermione, like, tells the story of the three brothers and the Deathly Hollows, it's a good scene. And I really like that they animated it, it I don't know, it just makes it feel unique. Um, Hermione's got a great voice, so it's, it's you know, it's, it's good hearing Emma Watson tell a bedtime story. But I think it is funny that I don't think they do that in this. I don't think so. Um, so let me... Okay, you need to do the other one. So let me just quickly get all these studs here. We're about halfway. We're See, that's the thing. You know, we keep getting halfway, and then we don't freaking do it. Kind of bumming me out here. See, these games remind me of kind of like um, point-and-click adventures. Like, you know, when you were a kid, you'd play like, your computer games, and you'd like, click on a bunch of stuff on the screen, and it would, like, do something. You know, like, you click on a pot and pan, and it would, like, jump up and down. Of course, these aren't just for kids, but, you know, I think it is pretty cool that they have that element where you shoot something and something will happen. You know, you don't just get studs. Sometimes random things happen. I think that's a really cool addition. I like it. Alright. Um, I don't... Th I think... See, that's real fire. Right there. That's not Lego, so I don't think you can put that out. See, look at that. They're playing... The chicken are playing the drums. <laughs> How long does this go for? Okay, whatever. Alright, Hermione, pull that. There we go. That's funny. Uh, I think we got everything in here, right? Man, this guy's effing crazy. Look at this stuff, man. Jeez. Alright. Let's go. Uh, Xenophili, see you up here. Oh, dude, what he, do what he does is literally... Oh, not yet. Okay. What he does, I think... I think it's in this game. It's not in the movie. <laughs> if you know, you know. What he's about to do in this level is friggin' nuts. <laughs> 
See, I make fun of Ron because he's an actual friggin' idiot in this game. You know, he's just like, lit, 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 lit. he'd be drinking his stupid water. Oh, there is the Tales of Beetle, Beetle, and the Bard, or Beetle the Bard. What if that's how it happened in the movie? She was just like, <laughs> Ron's like, nah, nah, nah. Mm. so Xenophilius is of course wondering where the fudge is Luna, the bad guy. Oh, are they gonna do what they did in the movie? How do they do this? Ah, oh, damn it, they didn't do it. Okay, so you do get to play through this, which is actually really friggin' cool. I wish they did that transition, though. This is cool. So you're playing right now as brother to... Okay, so just... They're just the brothers. Dude, you know, I talk a lot of crap on J.K. Rowling. I know she made this, but she is kind of nuts. And uh, I think that... Well, that's cool. I think that the theories... Look at this, man. This is so effing cool. This is awesome. It's like a story pop-up book. I think uh, a lot of the theories reg oh, that's sick. regarding who the brothers are, at, you know, really. Um, I think one of them was like, oh, the, the, the brother with death is Dumbledore. Dumbledore is death. Some crazy-ass theories, you know, that, of course, you know, because we would go, that's stupid. But in actuality, you know, J.K. Rowling comes out and she's like, yeah, that might work. I mean, it, it's pretty crazy that... I mean, she didn't, like, outright confirm, yes, that's canon. She didn't say no, either. So I think that's actually really neat how she kind of... She does kind of F with the material sometimes, and she's kind of a little political sometimes, but I do think that she... She's good to her fans when she's not being crazy, you know? And I think she's kind of an inspiration for different... Crea you know, like, I think I'm good with my fans. You know, if you guys want to see something, I'll probably do it, but... You know, I'm not as, of course, as influential as Harry Potter, but, you know, I'm something, but I'm not everything, but I do think that, uh, I think she, what the fudge, press, yeah, the ghost fiance, oh, dude, that's sick, what is this, like, Constance Hatchaway, Haunted Mansion, dude, this is sick, look at her, she's, like, coming down and floating, Oh, man, that was sick. That was really neat. See, I'm glad they didn't just tell you about that in the effing cutscene, you know? I'm glad you actually get to play it. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, I'm getting close, guys. I'm getting close to 50,000. Can we do it? Oh, what the heck? Uh... Okay, wait, we need, uh, Elder Wand guy. Boop! Wait. Pusha! Whoopacha! Skullyboopa! Here we go. I go down. What do I do? Oh, I see it. Alright, uh, Brother 2, you're pretty fat. Jump on here, we'll, we'll get going. I know that's not the spell. Whatever. Wink. Alright, get the money. Whoa. Oh, there's death. Dude, that looks sick. Look at that. See, why didn't they make a, uh... Visibility cloak. Why didn't they make death as a, uh... Lego set, man, that'd be so dope. Look how sick that looked, man, though. Like, TT Games, literally, they, they could have made Death as a set. And I would have bought it, you know, because that's cool. He looks sick in the movie, but actually seeing that there, that's pretty awesome, man. I like that. Uh, all right, I need Brother 1. Come on, Brother. Where'd you get that funky space suit, Brother? <sighs> oh. What the hell? How the, how the heck are... Whatever. 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 I'm not questioning it. Whatever. How do you survive that? Dude, these, this is really cool. You know, that you're actually playing it and not just seeing it through cutscene. I like that. 
But we're so close to 50,000 though, dude, this sucks. And I swear to God, if we don't get it, I'm gonna have some choice words. I'm gonna have some choice words for those developers. Alright, Resurrection Stone, baby! Alright, Constance, do your stuff. I like how she kind of floats and then walks. Okay. Oh, I see. I don't know if I was supposed to time that, but I... <laughs> screw it, I just, I just walked through. Dude, look at that, there's death again! Oh yeah. Okay, visibility cloak. Alright, here we go. See, it's, it, this is very smart that you're not just using... the thing, you're actually like... You're actually doing something. You know, it's like a little puzzle. What do I do here? No, don't kill me, no! What do I do? Hang on, wait a minute. Um, uh, no, no, no. Oh, sugar! Well, <laughs> I was getting close to 50. Till death killed me. Can I take it off here? That sounds weird. Well, what the fudge do I throw it at? Death? Oh, okay, sure. Cause you know, okay. And skadoosh. One more. Here's some death for yourself. A push -a! Yeah, suck it. Very cool. All right, brother number one. Whoosh kapala. Nice. Um, resurrection stone. All right, I'm using the stone, boys. Walking on water, Lego Jesus. Okay. See how it looks like grainy too, like old footage, the lines and everything. That's pretty cool. All right, let's have to do this. All right. All right, and nailed it. Uh, I don't know, guys. Fifty thousand is getting kind of out of reach here. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do it or not. Yeah, this is cool. It's like, uh... Whoa, okay. Oh, shoot. That's cool. I like that. I like that a lot, because it doesn't effing tell you to run. You have to run because you're sick. That's cool. Yeah, screw you, death. I'll put it back. How do you like them apples? Trying to kill me with a bridge. You're losing your touch there, bruv. Our brother number one, go push! Alright, let's build. Uh, resurrection. Constance. Her idle animation is neat. Alright, there we go. Ride it on up. And pull. Nice. Ruckashaw. Yeah, this is actually pretty long. I like it. I freaking like it. There's death. I don't like it. Okay, tell me in the comments, guys. Out of the Invisibility Cloak, the Resurrection Stone, and the Elder One, which one would you want most? I would probably say the Resurrection Stone, because, uh, you know, give me the Elder One. Kind of go into terrorist mode. And I'm not a bad person, but I mean, come on. You get the most powerful thing in the world. You're not going to not effing use it on your enemies. The uh, Cloak, though, is kind of dope, too, because, you know, if you want to go into, like, Area 51 or, you know, something weird, you can just do it. Whoa! 
Oh, come on, man. We're like 9,000 away. Poop bucket. Okay, what's this? What am I building now? Oh, an apple. No, give me that. No, poop. Oh, that's cool. Of course you can't get the stud. Son of a biscuit. Oh, man, we're close. We're so close. I swear to God if we don't get this, man. I swear. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Nice. Dude, I'm about to shite bricks. Lego bricks. Because if we don't get this... I'm gonna be pretty pooper pain. 48,560. Are you... Whoa. It's pretty dope. No! Oh my god, I'm actually mad about that, bro. Why? 2,000 away? Uh-oh. Oh, we're good. Oh, wait, no, we're not. Oh, we're really not good. Yeah, son. I almost died, but whatever. You can have this. Okay. Oh, boy. He's gonna steal a lot of apples with that. I like that. It's pretty badass how he just, like, willingly, willingly gives him his hand. Like, alright, I'm done. You can take me. I think he did that in the movie. One of them killed him. Committed suicide, which isn't good, but I don't... You know, I'm not going to show that here, but uh, I don't, I don't know which one that was. Everyone's asleep. Xenophilus is freaking out. Hermione's like, mah, 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 mah. Oh, uh, Hermione, you're done. <laughs> I mean, oh boy, you know, that was a long story. Um, oh, yes, Hermione, would you please do me, oh, her? Oh, yes, my daughter, Luna. <sighs> we used to dance together. It was a very strange dance. Here, I'll show you. It goes a little like this! Oh, yeah. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Holy crap, we're still going? Jeebus! I don't... I, I thought this level was gonna end after the first thingamajig, but jeez. You, um... Holy cow, we're still going. I'm not complaining, I love playing these, but... Fudge and crackers, we're still going. All right, dip in dough. I like that. This is a good level. I like the beginning. I like the middle with the three brothers. That was pretty cool. See, that's what you know. What I mean, these these games are very artistically different. You know what I mean? And I'm not I'm not a big art guy, but I do think that it, that it is kind of cool to. Uh... Oh wait, dude, that means I can get fifty thousand. Holy crap! Right. I think. We, we need, like, one more stud. That's it. Yes! 50,000. Fudge yeah, man. It only took a friggin' year, but we finally did it. I'm actually happy. That is awesome. That is awesome. Alright, we need a purple thing and a skeleton hand. That is sick, bro. Alright, we need a Hermione. All right, uh, hat, bottle, stars, moon, hat, veil, stars, moon, or what? Uh, vial. Sorry. Yeah, I really, I really thought that was it. I'm not kidding. I'm glad we're still going though, and I'm glad we got fifty thousand. That's pretty sick. Moon is in trouble, boyo. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? <clears throat> oh, I see. Oh, the Daily Prophet. Um, oh, shit. Harry, you're in the paper! Ron, I know. I'm wanted all over the Muggle and Wizarding world. Apparently I'm a terrorist or something. I don't know, whatever. Ron, get your, uh... Deluminator. Boop, boop, boop. Boop. My only issue with the Deluminator is that, uh... 
It's extremely slow. He freaking barely moves when he has it. Well, wait, what's the point of... Th what's the point of the thing, then? What, what's... Whatever. Okay, uh... Hermione, you can get jacked. How about that? Time to take some... Muggle steroids! Hermione, smash! <laughs> Don't F with me! Wow, she just broke a wall. Don't screw with me, Ron! Alright, is it Pid Wiggin or Pid Widgeon? I think it's Widgeon. Uh, okay, here we go. Okay, now I'm imagining this is the end, right? I think. I mean... Right? Oh my god, we're still going! Again, I'm not complaining, but holy cow! What the fuck? What kind of sick joke is this? Oh, we gotta find Luna, I see. Well, clearly she must be in the bedroom and not captive by Bellatrix Lestrange, right? I mean, it only makes sense. Okay, what are the... Ooh. Nice. Hey, Luna, you want... Oh, there she... Yes. Don't get too excited there, Hermione. <laughs> Who puts a carrot and a banana under your freaking bed? Okay, well, clearly she must be in this box. I mean, <laughs> Luna! What the... F I'm absolutely crazy. You know, I think we just gotta kill this guy. This is me mercy killing right here. Okay, I get it. He was desperate. I get it. But why are you putting on makeup? <laughs> Ooh, they found us. Later. Man, those kids suck. They're like, oh, your daughter's in trouble. You're crazy. We're getting attacked. Let's effing bail. <laughs> well, did it? Yeah, did it. We did it, guys. Wow, almost a half hour. That's crazy. This was a long level, but it was a very good level. Guys, we have one more level in the Deathly Hollows Part 1. We're going to go confront Bellatrix Lestrange and see if we can find Luna Lovegood. Thank you, guys, and we'll see you in the next video.